car's dirty. Don't film that. <laughs> you want me to pick up the amplifier? There you go. I'll let Cat do it. After you, sir. Okay. Oh, sweet. Excited? I, I am excited. What's up? What's up? That amp sounds so fing good. Dude. I know. Oh it's my God. really awesome. Hi, this is Kevin Deal from Upscale Audio, and I'm here with Kat. Ciao! Yeah, ciao. <laughs> she's, she's being Italian. <laughs> God damn it. Today, we have the new Pathos Impul Legacy, which just got here from Italy, and I'm so excited to do an unboxing video with Kat. Yes. Yeah. And I got to see it yesterday. And right, and then I found out that <laughs> they would not wait for me, and they actually already unboxed it, and then listened to it, Today they did it, and then scurried back, putting it back in the frickin' box, uh, thinking I would not find out about it. Is we were that like, true? Oh, shit, quick, 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 he's coming, he's coming. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> how annoying is that? Because I wanted to be here for the unboxing. So now we're gonna do a natural unboxing video, and look, this is a $50,000 amp. You know that in my reference system, I've got a pair of adrenalines, mm -hmm. and how badass is it? They're really badass. They are really badass, and I've got a, a, mm -hmm. a Synapse uh, preamp, and mm -hmm. you know, uh, and this is kind of like taking those pieces and putting them into a single box. It's a $50,000 amp, right? But I, I, I hate, I shudder to say this, it's a $50,000 bargain. Yeah. I mean, if you compare it to other integrateds that I've seen that cost that much money. I mean, this thing weighs uh, over 100 kilos. That's over 220 pounds. Yeah. And, uh, so that's a few humans of us yeah, stacked, yeah, stacked together. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. So, look, I want to show you something because only Pathos, look, this is a company that's a real manufacturer. They have a metal shop. They have a wood shop. They uh, stuff their own printed circuit boards there. Everything is made in Italy or within a very small range of the factory in Vincenza. This is, it's truly art. You Everything know. I play with Pathos is just quality. Yeah. It's beautiful. And wait until you uh, see. Look, I would pay 50 grand for the box, so let me show you. <laughs> Notice I finally got my name on something, right? How cool is that? And. I want to say I can pretend to be just as excited, but I'm like still even yeah. more excited to open it again. Can you, Mr. Cameron, can you come around here <laughs> and look at this engraved uh, case, which is on casters, by the way. It also comes with uh, struts on the bottom so you can use a forklift to move it, oh, okay. uh, should you choose to. Now, those have already been removed. Uh, so right now, I think we're just on the casters, right? I guess I better... Dummy up, huh? Yes. Okay. I'll go over here. I mean, I love that. I mean, this is not MDF. This is like uh, plywood, yeah. right? I mean, this is like uh, a tannoy loudspeaker, like it's right. birch ply, and <laughs> that's some cool stuff. All right. Now <laughs> we go here, and these are the your help? straps which are also made out of wood and they have rope and this is how you can remove the amplifier because okay. it's very very heavy and it also comes with a custom made <laughs> jack stand nice. i mean but look at i want to show you this this isn't some bullshit that they bought from you know overseas i mean this is i'm sure made uh by them in their metal shop i'm looking at and i suspect that or at least they're having it made, uh, you know, in Italy. So this is a little jack, so you can, there's, there's other ways you can take this out. We're gonna kind of speed things up for you. Yeah. I'll put it that way, okay? So there's your owner's manual, there's the power cord, nice. there's some tools, and I think this all comes out, does it not? Oh yeah, this, this whole top head comes out. Oh, the whole top comes yeah. out. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Oh, we have to go to use the handle. These are not handles to move the whole amp. It says here these are not weight bearing. This is to take the lid off. Right, 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 right. 
Okay, ready? Got it? Okay, over here. <laughs> and the amp is still warm from when they played <laughs> played it and tried to Busted. hide it from me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. When I was rowing, we used to have to strap down boats all the time. Yeah. Cat used to be uh, a rower. Yeah. You were? Yeah, I used to row crew way back when. <laughs> Oh, that shit. was when you were not learning. I know. Piano. Pia <laughs> and what else? Violin. Violin. And didgeridoo. And no. didgeridoo. I really wish I could play didgeridoo though. Oh, yeah. As soon as I know what a didgeridoo is. <laughs> I know. Okay. Here we go. Oh, All right. God. Now we got that. All right. Now, <laughs> is this the unveiling? This is some badass stuff, and I'm gonna break it down to you in another video. Because uh, I want to talk about uh, the volume control right. and the way that they have used special low noise relays. Uh, my store manager, my sales manager, Ken, uh, it was blown away by this thing and it wasn't even broken in. Now, I think that they did give, run these and put some time on them because this is one of the very, very first production units and oh they want to make sure everything is beautiful. But they have put some new technology and engineering into their impulse circuit uh, on this amp that they've never done before that makes it uh, kind of um, no muss, no fuss as mm. you uh, own it uh, down into the decades and uh, just make it where anybody, I mean, this is not for anybody. I mean, it's a hundred watts per channel of class A, yeah, but it's in pole class A. And so, you know, it's going to run a little toasty, but it's the sound of it. These are very, very, these take a very long time to make. Mm -hmm. It's not something that we're going to have a, a lot of them or anything like that. This is the first one. There's another one that is being built now, that's being shipped, and and uh, we hope to get it out for uh, a this review very soon. This is so and, beautiful. Yeah, isn't it something? Yeah. So look, uh, keep an eye out for this. Keep an eye out for more news on it. I'll be doing a video where I kind of show you uh, the insides of this product because I got to tell you something. When they call this legacy, they mean it. They have poured their heart and soul into this for a very, very, very long time, but that's what... I appreciate that too about actually like you and us like showing a legacy amp, the insides and explaining the technology. Yeah. Like what makes this $50,000 yeah. and worth it? Like it's a rarity that people can get that information from you <sighs> and their staff. Like it's, I don't know, this is cr incredible. It, you need to know what you get for your money. It's so a different status, it yeah. It is a different thing. I got, I mean, just the relays, <laughs> uh, just the relays and the volume control by itself is is in another class. Uh, I've been reading up on what they have done and it is something, so cool. All right. Woo, Woo. <laughs> let's fire it up again. Yeah, all right, all right guys. Say goodbye, Kat. Okay, bye. Bye, ciao. Ciao. <laughs>